Uh, first of all, I'd like to uh, congratulate Sinn Féin and the Alliance Party on their success uh, in the Stormont elections. Uh, they now have to deliver for the people, uh, and people will hold them to account uh, if they don't deliver. I also want to congratulate uh, the AIM2 team in the North for our advance electorally in the North. <clears throat> AIM2 uh, had the largest increase in votes amongst nationalist parties in the North and came ahead of more established political parties, uh, such as people for profit. And it, it begs the question, if a small party like AIM2 can do it, why can't Fianna Fáil do it? Um, the election is also significant, because now it actually puts the votes for pro-Irish unity political parties on a par with unionist political parties, and it makes the lack of preparation for unity more reckless every day. And the election also returned a majority of MLAs who support the protocol and support the resumption of the executive without any precondition whatsoever. And yet we have the, exactly the same situation as we had before the election. We have the institutions of the Good Friday Agreement on the floor, unimplemented and not working. And the minority political party stopping the whole process from working. So I would like to ask the teacher, what actions will you take to ensure that the institutions of the Good Friday Agreement are actually fully implemented and are up and running?